Shelley Pearsall began her career as a museum historian. She's worked in an upper elementary school as a teacher, and she writes award-winning books, including books for middle grade readers. Her book, Trouble Don't Last, won a Scott O'Dell Award for historical fiction. And that's the common thread woven through her books. She loves history. Her book, Trouble Don't Last, is about 11-year-old Samuel, a Kentucky slave, and Harrison, an elderly slave. Together they plot and then attempt to escape north via the Underground Railroad. The book, Crooked River, is about 12-year-old Rebecca. Her father brings home a Native American to stay in their 1812 Ohio homestead. This Native American has been falsely accused of murder. Rebecca finds it very disturbing to think that an innocent man could not only be convicted of this crime, but could also be put to death. All of the above is about five middle school students, their teacher, and other community members that get together as a project and build the world's largest tetrahedron. It's an amazing accomplishment and it impacts their lives in different and sometimes surprising ways. All Shook Up is about 13 year old Josh that goes to visit his father in Chicago and is surprised, actually shocked, horrified to find out his father has become an Elvis Presley impersonator. Pearson's The Seventh Most Important Thing is about 13-year-old Arthur, who is sentenced to community service for throwing a rock at the neighborhood junkyard in a fit of rage. Sentenced to help this man around the neighborhood, he collects junk that might be much more important than he would have imagined. Middle grade students will enjoy these books. And Shelley Pearsall writes books for teenagers too, so when middle grade students get introduced to her writing now, they'll be able to find more good books over the next several years as they get older. You can find most of Shelley Pearsall's books at a library. Just ask your friendly local librarian to help you.